All I've wanted is to win a state title. It's been the goal since. It's been the goal since I stepped off the track at regionals last year. You're two time gold medal Tell me about the race that you ran. I mean, did you just run it the way you need to? I honestly I don't remember it. I was zoned in from the minute I got in the blocks. I just knew what I had to do. I knew what I wanted to do. And I, I did it. I came over. I remember coming over the eighth hurdle. Just peeking around me and didn't see anybody there and I was just like, hold on, keep finish, finish the race, finish the race. Well and your read and your prelim yesterday was was impressive too. I mean did you run a good race yesterday as well? I did, yeah. Yesterday was a PR and then today was a PR off of yesterday. So Nick, this just kills me because you know, you see guys that you know, okay, they're gonna be contenders. And Nick, you just I mean, do you just feel like I made myself a state champion? I made myself a state champion. I it's it's unreal. I, one thing I would like to say is to any JV kids out there, just never give up. I mean, that's what, that's what I did. That's what you got to do. Keep working. Just keep working. Just dream. Just believe in yourself. And you can accomplish whatever you think you can. I mean, it's... A year ago, I was still running JV races. I was still thought I was a sprinter. Coach Swartz saw the talent in me, and I was, he was right. And but that's the thing. Just never give up. You're never out until you're graduated. And you're never out until state meet after your senior year. Just a year of Carroll in lane four. And in lane two, that was running back up Carroll. Now in lane two, that is the Beaston. Now the old